We're gonna start with a new speed run. We're gonna be doing our boss speed run. So we're gonna be playing against all the bots on chess.com. I think I should be able to beat like all of them. There are about a hundred bots roughly if I if I count the numbers correctly until we get to uh number number one, the engine, which basically is a better version of mittens as I understand it. So let's get going. Let me click choose. Uh let's do challenge white or black and let me start the uh start the timer and here we go. So the first couple of bots should be pretty straightforward here. We're playing against Chess GPT, not to be confused with Chat GPT, which of course um, was bought by Microsoft. A better version, that is my understanding. Okay, so let's play C5. Chess GPT, of course, 249. Chat GPT, by the way, which Microsoft did buy 49% of. Apparently, there was a game against Stockfish that it tried to play, and it did not go very well. Okay, A4 is actually a good move. I'll play B4 here. Well, I beat them as both white and black. I think I'll just, I'll leave it up to chance. Uh, basically, much like the NFL, um, I'm going to leave the games up to chance in terms of the color and the, the algorithm will decide just like in the NFL, the referees decide what happens in the games. Let's play Bishop G4 here. Thank you so much to Aiden G for the prime. Thank you so much to Al Braxo for the prime as well. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, that's a free queen. I will gladly take. Um, let's play H6 here. Attack Knight when the pawn on E4. Throwing shade. I mean, what do you want me to say? Okay, so Chat GPT is probably not. I wonder, is Chat GPT better than Chess GPT or not, you guys? I've got the jokes. Yes, you guys. Um, I wasn't watching the game last night, but of course, I saw everybody was up in arms because typically, uh, as always, the referees made some bad calls and it changed the outcome of the game potentially. Okay, so let's just take the bishop. Okay, so starting with Chess GPT, this will probably be very straightforward for the first few bots, at least. Um, I will have to manually have I will manually have to update the uh, score. So, give me one second. Let's take the rook, take the knight. I will just take the rook, make the queen. This will be very very straightforward here. Um, one second. Where is it? Um, so we just take the pawn. Let's go rook b8, rook b3. Very, very straightforward. Every NFL seems to have one to two bad calls indeed. Um, that is checkmate. Let me stop the timer for one second while I open the, uh, while I update the score. Give me one second. I have to do this manually. Of course, like I said, you guys, a little bit slow um, starting out. So it is what it is. There we go. All right. Let's keep going um, with our next game. So we've got our first win. Let me go back to the bot list. Okay, so we beat chess gp let's play against um challenge white or black and here we go let's start with chippy let's play e4 here let me start the timer as well let me play oh let's play the king's gambit because i did a video on the king's gambit last night for youtube okay let's play knight to f3 here uh i will play bishop c4 why am I playing the bots so low rated? I'm playing all the bots, you guys. We're gonna play all the bots and beat all the bots. G4, 95, King F1, now I go D4. Very, very good. Nice video, by the way. Thank you so much. Why do I have the Austrian? What? Wait, why do I have the Austrian? Austrian flag, what the heck? I didn't do that, you guys. Chess.com must be glitching out. What can I say? Um, That's not me. By the way, I am losing here, but the computer's so bad that it will just lose. Um, let's just take. Actually, this is weird. Uh, this is actually kind of weird. How am I? What am I doing here? I guess I'll just take. I'm actually losing here with correct play objectively. I'll go here, attack the rook. Go here, guard the pawn. I'm, I'm actually just losing. But I will win. Let's go queen one and trade. Okay. Or this. Yeah, losing to the 700. I was losing. But there's checkmate. Okay, so let's play the next spot. So we're two out of two. Uh, let's go to the next next spot. Play pal 9,000. Play knight of six here. We're two and oh. Let's just take. B5. This will play C6 and takes here. Go Bishop B7. Let's go E6. Third bot is 1200 already. Apparently it is. Play Knight BD7 here. 
Does Magnus haunt your dreams? No, Magnus does not haunt my dreams, you guys. That's right. This is my first stream since I came back from uh, from the desert. So, um, yeah, just to talk a little bit while, while we're doing this. Um, yeah, I'm typing because I have to update the score, resave the file, which is really quite annoying, I have to be honest. Um, uh, yeah, so so I played in the Air Things Masters, obviously. Um, didn't quite go the way I wanted at the end, but overall very happy with my performance. Um, since I do not play chess professionally, as I've said a million times, I did very little preparation before the before the event, before the games, frankly. Uh, did I just hang a knight? I did, didn't I? Um, oh, he misses it. Let's check and trade here. Uh, but I did no preparation, basically. Like, I, I had to get on a plane on Saturday. Basically, Saturday morning, I got a call. I had to get on a plane Saturday, Saturday afternoon into the evening. And then, of course... Um, I did no preparation. I just showed up and played, and I, I found a way to finish second. So overall, I'm very, very happy with the result. Very, very happy, all things considered. Oh, we're gonna get a win here because I fossilized him with the knight to queen h1. Let's just drop back. Um, take. Go bishop e5 here. Attack the knight and take the pawn on f3. Next move. Just take and go b4 here. Pal 9000 appears in a Disney film. Uh, what is Pal 9000? I don't know who Pal 9000 is. Uh, were you never interested in making a chessable course? I will probably do some chessable stuff down the road. Um, not to throw shade, but I'll throw shade anyway. Uh, I was a little bit disappointed that when um, Chess.com did their big announcement around the merger between Chess.com and the uh, Play Magnus group, they basically said everybody else was doing a course and they didn't say anything about me. Um, but I do intend to do some courses. So I was very weird that they didn't mention anything, but uh yeah <laughs> yeah exactly let's play b3 here uh let's just go b2 here how do i feel about the arm again as the times reveal i thought the 858 was just hilarious i thought it was very funny um let's play rookie two here and this game very very quickly thank you so much to rachel crater for the prime roger is here for the prime and radar with the prime thank you so much to radar um let's just trade the rooks let's go queen e2 take the bishop Go here and here and end the game. This should be checkmate at once. So next game coming up. All right, so let's go back and play the next bot. Um, okay, let's play against uh, play against Skyweb. Play against Skyweb. Uh, challenge random color and away we go. Next game. Um, let's play. Doesn't matter. I'll still play Sicilian here. Very very straightforward. Get the score. Waste a few seconds every every game. Kind of annoying, but it is what it is. Okay, there we go. All right, let's play D6 here. Play real humans, no bots. I want I want to play bots. Um, for right now we're doing our bot speed run. What 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 about the turkey turn? Yeah, we'll be doing that a little bit later on, you guys, in a couple of hours. Of course, that that did happen. Um, it was what middle of last week or was that late last week? Um. There, of course, was a horrible earthquake in Turkey and Syria. Affected a lot of people. Many people dead. Uh, many people died, unfortunately. So very, very sad. Very sad. Let's go B4, fork the Knights. We're going to get a win here. Next game is going to be very serious. Next game we're going to be playing against... Um, we're going to be playing against uh, uh, Agent Smith. Okay, I'll take it with a pawn. Yeah, it's 35,000 people. I mean, it's just, yeah, really, really sad. How did you hear about the Turkish earthquake help turn from Twitter? I saw it on Twitter. Yeah, I saw chess.com was doing something. So it's a uh, very good cause. And um, hopefully, hopefully people, hopefully there's support and people, people are okay as much as they can be. The queen has like, thoughts on starting a fashion career. You're asking me the fashion question about Ali Reza Farouge. I'll talk about that a little bit later on, actually, because I do have some thoughts. Um, I do have some actual thoughts on that, but, but not right now. Let's go F4 here, attacking the bishop. Yeah, I mean the whole whole thing is really really tragic as far as as far as Turkey is concerned. When will viewers' games review be out on YouTube? I re-recorded that last night as well. Uh, I take the bishop, win the queen, win the rook. Everything is really really good here for me. Go queen e6, trade some queens. My hair looks incredible, but that, that's that's because I literally um, I literally woke up and shower. I, I I hit the start stream button and then I ran into the shower as fast as I could. So. Um, if you're wondering why I was a little bit late starting, that's actually the reason. Yeah. Why the Austrian flag? Because the because somebody who should have become the president of the United States of America was in the Terminator movies featuring bots. So um, that's why. 
go queen e2 attack the rook attack the pawn I can I can go rook c2 and the game very soon come on Skyweb time to resign thank you so much for just playing emo for the gift of sub and uh, thank you so much to trocar for the bits thank you so much to and to spicy extra for the 19. just take thank you to Haganiko for 34 Scotty D for the two J kill thank you to Zymanimi as well thank you to Arsenal for the 19 as well appreciate it. um let's take a mate next game coming up next game by the way going to be a very important game so let me pause the timer for a second so next game is the fifth game we're going to be playing against uh against the bots let me update the score as well we're gonna be playing against agent smith who i believe is um is uh is 2700 so let me save reset the file there we go okay so next game agent smith who is raid 2700 we're gonna play challenge either color and we get serious let's get serious now i played sicilian i'm gonna play sicilian against you it plays the same opening or not your opening is the plague and we are the Q okay um okay queen h5 is pretty funny I'm gonna be honest because this is an opening that I played this is the opening that I played I played this in um I played this in Zurich no it was Zurich or Genève um it was I think no it was actually in Lausanne the Lausanne Young Masters in uh Switzerland in 2000 and I believe three against Andre uh Andre Volokitin from the Ukraine Slava Ukraina of course um so I was against Vola Keaton that, that I played this. I lost the game with the white pieces. So, oh, timer stop. Sorry, let me restart. Ah, let's restart it. Sorry, right, let's stay with the queen. Yeah. Go knight g8, knight e7, knight c6. I think there's that menacing moles for the prime. Funky Justin, the average chess player for the two months as well. Um, I can play knight c6 here. I can also go knight e7. I think I'm going to play. I'm going to go knight c6 and knight e7, knight f5. Turn the clock on. Clock is running. What do you mean? Oh, turn the light on? No, the light, the light, pineapple is on behind me. What do you mean? Sorry, you scared me. Pineapple is on. Yeah, now I could play H6 and G5. Let's get aggressive here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I got scared, so I looked just to make sure it was on, because I thought, wait, maybe it's not on. Let's go G5, Knight G6, Bishop G7. I'm doing very well here. Um, I think Knight G6 is good. Hit the pawn. Ah, but he's got C3. I played this... Should have gone Bishop G7 first. How do I do this actually? I guess I'll go here. I think I'm gonna take to force a structure to fix it. I can play F5 maybe. Um, I think I'm gonna castle and play F5 here. Or F6. I mean, both moves are playable. I mean, F6 is probably better if I want to force the trade, but F5 is also very reasonable. I'm going to trust my instinct that F6 is right. I think there's a wandering bishop for the 45 months. Okay, it goes queen D3. Now, I can play F5 here if I want. Queen F7 was my initial instinct um, to take. Knight B5, maybe? Is that the idea? Knight D6, E4? No, that's no good. So let's go here. Now there's pressure on the pawn on d4 i can play queen f5 i can also just go like rookie eight queen f5 actually looks like a very good move to force the queens off the board here now i take with the rook or the pawn i take with the rook pawn takes allows knight takes pawn knight b5 that looks like a dubious move doesn't look right so let's go rook d8 stop knight d6 i could have played a6 knight d6 sack the exchange wait a6 rookie six did i blunder this a6, rookie 6, knight f8, knight d6, rook f3 is winning. I think a6 is... a6 looks right, because takes, I go knight f8, knight d6. Oh, I missed knight c7, whoops. But I do have e5, I guess. That was actually really careless. Um, I didn't see knight c7, or I wouldn't have played this. Shoot. Oh, uh, let me think for a second. Knight h4, maybe? Knight h4, knight e6, knight f3. King h1, knight d2, knight d8. Yeah, I blundered. No, rook sack is what I want to do. Um, well, there's knight e6 always. I messed this up. I still can draw with e5, but I just forgot about knight c7. Can I explain why I'm so clever? I don't know what you mean by so clever. If I play rook d6, knight rook d7, rook e2... I'm thinking about takes, 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 rookie eight, knight seven, knight f3, but there's king h1 there. Um, e5 looks like the right move somehow, but. E5 
E5 looks right. Um, I think I have to play it. I don't want to play it, but I think I have to. Knight E6, I go rookie 8. Yeah, I mean, it's probably just a draw. Resign and retry. Yeah, no, not resign. I mean, I'm, I can draw the game. That's not the issue. The issue is, can I win the game? And it's... I mean, I have to take... If Bishop C3, I have D4. I'm going to play in the Turkey Charity Tournament later. Yes, I'll take... Maybe a mistake. He's rook f4, which, of course, was wrong. I mean, I can probably draw with rook e2, but... Let's see. H5 is enough to draw. King g6 is okay. H5, bishop c3 is just going to be a draw. I'm going to try to win with d4. Probably is going to be a draw. We'll try to win again uh, next game, I guess. We have h5 here. Rook c5, rook c2 looks fine as well, but... Don't want to play h5, but I think I should just to stop rook g4. Take away a pawn from being on a dark square. It's no longer a weakness. Let's go here. Maybe rook c2. C2, rook b3, b5 maybe. Or maybe just b5. Right? Even knight e5 is a move here. Oh, knight e5 is rook f5 though. So I can't go knight e5. Rook c2 looks like the safe move. b5 also fine. I guess I'll go here. Rook b3, b5. King d3, rook c5. Why no clock? Uh, because we're playing the bots. Did I just blunder? I did just blunder. Yay. I guess I go a5 and I have rook g5 maybe. Yeah, I think I go... Because if I go b4, there's check. So I go here. Because now I have g3, I have b4. Okay. I guess rook g3 is just a draw probably. Oh, he plays rook a6. Interesting. Now, I can check and draw. I guess I'll check. I'm going to go king d2. I'll check. Can't come up to the check. There are now new bots because of the Super Bowl. Ah, okay. I didn't see the Super Bowl bots. Um, Go here. I can draw the game, but a draw is not what I want. So, maybe I'll just play... Rook g6, rook b6 doesn't do anything. Probably I'm supposed to take a draw. Super Bowl bots are only 1,000. Okay. Okay, I'll just make the draw and then I'll retry against Agent Smith in a, after I play Super Bowl bots. Let me just go back. Um, okay, let's let's go back. Oh, let me stop the timer. Um, let, let me go back. Let me play the, the Super Bowl bots first. Take the draw and play again. Yeah, I will play again. At, at a certain point, when I, when, of course, is a fun speed run. Um, when I play the super strong ones, I'm basically not going to count a loss until I give up. So, like, if I lose a game, I'll try again and again and again. And then when I finally give up after like ten games or something, I get adopted. I will count it as a loss. That's how we're going to do it. Just for those of you guys who are wondering. So let's be the super Bowl bots first, and then go back to Agent Smith. Um, are the bot ratings uh, accurate? Mm, in between, it's it's a mix. Adopted equals a loss. I think that's actually a fair way of putting it. All games are with black. I do either white or black. Both colors. There were no World Cup bots, but there are Super Bowl bots. Of course, you guys. Chess.com is based here in America. Here in America, we call about we care about football. It's a real sport. Not some game where you have people like Neymar just flopping all over the field like they've been shot. Uh, thank you so much to Lee Geek. Yeah, let me start the timer as well. Um... Go Knight BD7 here. Thank you so much to Lee Geek for the 30 months. Thank you Salvatar for the 15. Gray Marmalade for the 24. And Millsap for the 16. Uh, let's play B5 here. Thank you so much to Captain Haddock for the Prime. Thank you to Melt for the Prime. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Let's go B4. Rare Hikaru L. What's the L, uh, what's the L about this? By the way, this Philadelphia bot is pretty terrible. Uh, let's just take and take. Thank you so much to Kyanor for the Prime. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Um... Neymar is greater than the Super Bowl? Yeah. That's not an L. How is that an L? Everybody knows it's true. Even Brazilians know it's true. Thank you so much to Unknown for sure for the Prime. Thank you so much to the Catter for the Prime. Thank you so much. You got a problem with Philly coming at me? No, I don't actually. Uh, not really. Take the pawn at A2. 
Oh, we're gonna beat we're gonna beat the Eagles in a second. And a commercial last night claimed American football was invented in Canada. Thoughts? Was it? I mean, ba basketball was right because because uh, James Naismith was from Canada, uh, even though even though he spent most of his life in America. But football. I mean, they, they have the Grey Cup, but the Grey Cup surely came after the Super Bowl and everything. No, they have the CFL. I'm aware of the CFL, but um, that doesn't sound right. I'm going to beat all the bots. that were. I, I don't expect to take super long because probably most of the bots, except for the top 10, are, are roughly pretty straightforward and should be easy to beat. Did I say soccer, football? Uh 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 what do you football we're talking about american football by the way is today a holiday or something okay let's just take the rook make a queen uh check and there we go all right let's play the uh kansas city chief spot also 1000 Thank you so much to Grey Whip Moose for seven, $7.77. Thank you, Xylet Vicars for the promise. Play the beef eater, of course. I feel like in Kansas, they eat a lot of beef, right? Isn't it like brisket and beef and all that stuff? So it's a very fitting opening to play. Update your draw. No, I'm going to play it again in a second. I'm going to play it again and try to beat it. That's, that's, why I didn't put the, that's why I didn't put the score. No, no, that's not how I'm going to score this, you guys. Uh, I already explained how I'm going to score this. I'm going to play it like up to 10 games. And if at the end I can't beat it, then I'll count it as a draw. And likewise, if I lose 10 in a row to one of the bots, like Komodo at the very end, that will count as a loss. I'll probably get adopted by Komodo at the end, at the end of the speed run. Very, very likely. Thank you so much to Black Sudasol for the 16 months. Appreciate it. Uh, Magnus bot is not on chess.com. Uh, when Levy did his video and I did our video, we basically took the bot from, uh, from the Play Magnus app and that's how we played against it. So that's what we did. That's what we did, you guys. We're playing a botless trade. I mean, this is very much like playing against Kansas City Chiefs. They 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 have no defense; they only have offense. So, of course, of course, it doesn't trade the queens because Kansas City Chiefs and defense are or more like Andy Reid and defense never go together. I think so much a blind put for the forty-eight months. Yeah, if the Chiefs didn't have Patrick Mahomes, they would lose every game 35-0, basically. Let's play A5. Yeah, we had D last night. You give up 35 points and you have D. I'm sorry, dude. I don't even follow football closely anymore, and I'm sorry. But if you give up 35 points, you don't know how to play D. Let, let's be honest. That's Castle here. Yeah, I, I, I didn't claim I didn't claim the Eagles had D either. I'm just saying the Chiefs have never had D. Andy Reid, all, all he does is try to have a team that can score 500 points every game and never plays D. But of course, in the modern NFL, where basically the, the rules are all about protecting the QB, it's not shocking that football's become so uh, so offense heavy. Let's play Knight C3. Astonishing lack of D. I remember the good old days, you guys. Back in like the 90s when you had great teams like the New York Giants and Bill Parcells. You had like Lawrence Taylor. You had great defense. You know, you go back to like the Bears or even the Ravens in the early 2000s. That's the football that I remember, the football that I love. So you can call me a boomer for having that opinion, but that's my honest opinion. I think it's over to Triogami for, uh, for the 15 months. Go B5 here. I have no D. Well, none that I'm proud of. Very funny. Very funny. Very funny. Let's go B3. Oh, there was a Steelers too. Yeah. Let's go B2. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's go A1 Queen. Let's take the Rook. Okay. We're going to beat Kansas City. I'm going to circle back to Agent Smith in a second. Do I follow NBA basketball? I followed basketball when I was young. Um, I followed the New York Knickerbockers. Or wait. There's just checkmate one. Okay, so let's play the next bot. Um, new game. And let's go back to Agent Smith. Okay, let's go back to Agent Smith. Challenge, uh, and here we go. All right. 